this rumor going out there that this lady's product doesn't work and that she has undergone surgery to sell these products i expect any institution with integrity to come out and say that disregard the rumors because this product has gone through a thorough clinical trial to ascertain for a fact that this product really works and so disregard the rumor this is the comprehensive report that we run on the checks and this is what we came out with and so please disregard the rumor I was for MCI a boy, and in Simia Betuja, FI FD, who was the FDA, and come on, you man say, who better share a Driani and Afin soon draw dry and no senior Bebuana, a quinipedri anymore, how Biara emblem. So, Swampa, a German, seven sabbath fratch, or Bissa, or Mutimi, and yen ye paddy, a son say, FA fella Macafini product are all torn in who say FDA for a jatum, chesse, ye no ma, and foul how Bia emba. Into no FDA for we are sure pass and we are sure we are pa Emma so be no my uncle for or how Emma just all casa now shan any agree ye pa yanko yanko tien summer would do be a MC a ye boa at the two dry FI FDA for Emma ye buy at was so Eddie Amom. Hello everybody, I am MC Ayabwa. This is a video to follow up on the FDA video I did concerning leaflets not present in most of the herbal products approved by the FDA. Now, the thing is that I reached out to the FDA to make this complaint and the FDA responded back to me. They said, and I'll put the message on the screen so that everybody can read. The FDA said, and I retreat, they said that it is mandatory that every herbal product that have been approved should be sold in the market with the leaflet with a comprehensive report on the drug attached to it. That is what the FDA tells me. So the FDA says that it is mandatory, which means to say, herbal medicine producers say, Okay. Now that's what the F the message the FDA sent me. Now this is a the question I want to ask. According to the law, every pharmacy be a woman man term one, there should be a distance of ten kilometers. And to say me to me rabbi four pharmacies a woman me man term one. Now me realize I say herbal products are what shelves ni soon ni na. There is no leaflet in them giving a comprehensive report on the medicine, which means say. I can confidently say that all the pharmacies across the nation shop will be a ube ra ube picking about 10 herbal products, you know, ube nya emu eta leaflets be a encounter, and that is a big problem. So now I want to ask the FDA, and I have been calling and asking, and the feedback I keep getting is that we are working on it, we are investigating. Is the FDA telling me that they are not aware that all these drugs on the shelves that are being sold? shelves in all the pharmacies across the nation no that have registration and approval from the fda the fda is not aware that all these products are being sold without the leaflets that they claim is mandatory for them to add to the medicine no omon fan count is the fda saying they are not aware upon all the resources at your disposal upon all the salaries that is being catered for by Ghanaians, taxpayers, and the resources that are available at your disposal. No? It took me, an individual, MC Yaeboa, to find out and bring to your attention that all these drugs that are being sold doesn't have any leaflets in them. You should be ashamed of yourself. The CEO of FDA is Madame Delacy Mimidako. Please. What is your quality and monitoring team? What are they doing? Are we paying them taxpayers' money to sit in the office? Are you people taking fat salaries just to sit in air conditions in the office and close at 5 p.m. and go home? And that you are not making sure that all the drugs that are being consumed by the innocent Ghanaians, no, I'm a taxpayers, I'm a tax, no, you are not giving them adequate information to make informed decisions about their health? I will come back to that. Now let's go to the recent trending topic, which is basically simply snatched by Fela Makafui. And honestly speaking, I sympathize with Fela Makafui with what she's going through with her marital life. 
and I'm in no way or in no situation trying to push her down, even when it seems as though she's going through a lot. I sympathize with her a lot. But let's talk about the fact of the issue here. Simply snatch when you go on their business page, you no know, product is approved by the FDA pair, what they say there. When you go on their story, they have posted an FDA certification that shows that their product is approved. Now, from what I know, I know in order to get a certification from the FDA, that product ha would have to go through a clinical trial to ascertain for a fact that this medicine is really, really capable of doing what they claim to be advertising it to do. Now, this rumor going out there that this lady's product doesn't work and that she has undergone surgery to sell these products, I expect any institution with integrity to come out and say that disregard the rumors because this product has gone through a thorough clinical trial to ascertain for a fact that this product really works and so disregard the rumor this is the comprehensive reports that we run on the checks and this is what we came out with and so please disregard the rumor but if that is not done then this goes to show that once again the fda has failed the ordinary Ghanaian, and you do you will not we cannot trust you people to 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 sort of look over the things that we are supposed to be consuming as a nation because we have heard we have seen several times that the fda has goro boys that take money from vendors to approve their products if this is not clarified by the FDA, then it goes to show that the rumors are true. And there is no shame in an institution admitting to the fact that they made a mistake and so they are withdrawing the drug from the market. AstraZeneca, the people that did the COVID, the COVID, um, you're kind of saying, uh, uh, vaccines, today they are recoiling their medicine from the market because they they are withdrawing their medicines from the market. That is what any in a company with integrity will do. So the FDA, if simply snatched, is indeed approved by the FDA and has gone through the necessary clinical trials to ascertain that this tea or this combo, because it's a combo and it's ridiculously expensive, 850 Ghana cities for a combo, to make my tummy flat. If indeed these products have gone through that, the FDA should come out and tell Ghanaians that disregard the rumor. These are the clinical trials that we run. These are the results that came out. So for a fact, Simply Snatch can actually do the job. If not, then we have a big problem on our hand as Ghanaians. And the whole excuses of we are working on it, we are working on it, it's not acceptable by us. We have been quiet for far too long. And right now, we are only acting out of fear because the drugs that we are supposed to be consuming to make us better, it's making us worse. And FDA, my biggest problem with you people is that these so-called vendors that are selling things on social media, on, on, in the truck truck stations, on the market, they are not doing it in the dark. They are doing it in broad daylight. And you people, till today, we have people selling drugs. Ah, bottom, market, twenty. Now, so said the mass population of Ghana had them saying, Sebi Sebi in Predia Samano de Sumina so are illiterate. Ain't in Yayatisa will be can and no near Befa. Ain't he a dean GDA Pani a Bewa institution to say FDA? Ah, Madame de Lacey Mimi Daku would down no sepedin GDA. And as he say, the ordinary Ghanaian no, and was he a war ever FDA mo? We cannot trust you people. When I sent the FDA message, they concluded by telling me if I've seen any medicine like that on the market, I should send them evidence. Me should send you evidence. Me. You, you don't know. This big institution with all the resources at your disposal, you do not know. And I will post the video here. I don't care the brand that is involved. Because upon about 8 to 10 bottles that I picked up on the shelf, it was only one medicine that had a leaflet in it. Solar Kebal Mixture. I will mention the brand. 
Solak Herbal Mixture was the only brand that had a leaflet in it giving a comprehensive report on the medicine. Enocrine policy saying I was here checking position said your match on Enocrine. No disrespect. But Solak Herbal Mixture, pe, apart from Solar Herbal Mixture, almost all the famous medicines that I picked up on the shelf didn't have any leaflets in them. And we are supposed to be consuming this. How are we supposed to get in? How are we supposed to make informed decisions? I am not trying to ruin. I am not trying to ruin anybody's business. But I believe that if you have sat and watched anybody close to you die out of a medicine that they are supposed to take to make them better, maybe you understand my pain and where this is coming from. And so we can only expect that the institutions that are being paid by the ordinary Ghanaians tax, tax are yet, you know, at least the least you people can do is to respect Ghanaians and do your work like you are supposed to do. We are not going to blame government anymore. We will pay on various institutions that are being paid by government to do their job for government. Please. This time around, that's what we will do. I was in a funny summer hold where MCI a boy edit to Daniel Connie could see a message or bass or drop a comment, share and like he said, you'll be answer betting me a cavity. If you didn't have no who's who are a move from a crummy message, share it.